Hi Libra, welcome to Empowered by Divine. My name is Melody Rose and I am your earthly star seed. I'm going to be doing a reading today for you for the next two weeks after this video finds you. Okay, next two weeks after this video finds you, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. I'm going to tap into two energies. You pick what side you're on, okay? Energy number one, how are they feeling overall? Energy number one for Libra, for the collective, please, for Libra. I do put the intentions in for the subscribers, so go ahead and subscribe, okay? Um, let's see, energy number one, please. Libra, Libra. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus, please. Energy number one. This is intended to be a love reading, however you can uh, use this for other relationships in your life. One ring circus and coming together. So this person may be very single right now. Feel like they're juggling a lot on their own, but things are coming together or um, things are coming together for this person. I'm gonna leave that out. I feel like they're having the strength to do so, seeing the strength card. Energy number one, please. For Libra, energy number one for Libra overall. Overall energy, please, for number one for Libra. Thank you. I feel like they're coming to some truths that is going to help move them and propel them forward. Um, High Priestess of Air, and then we have High Priestess of Spirit coming out as well. So I feel like they're getting help from Spirit uh, on this new journey that they're going to be going through here this new truths. I feel like, yeah, they're listening to their guides here. They're saying this one. Okay. Energy number one, please, for Libra. Woo! Thank you. So I had the strength card show and, oh my gosh, look at this. Strength again. So I feel like this person is bursting out of their shell in some way. Um... And having the strength to do so because look now we have power and I said shell and I feel like they're coming out of this solitude energy they're coming out of their own karma that has been serving them for generations they're breaking curses Libra you're breaking generational cycles whoever is on this side that these karma cycles were very strong and you have been stronger Look at that. It's time to release the negativity. I wasn't even going to use this. Yeah, good things are coming. But that's just telling me right there that these cycles are breaking. And I feel like there have been generational um, shifts, um, generational cycles that you guys have been in. Wow, very powerful. Okay, energy number two, please, for Libra. Thank you. Flying. Wow, you're breaking cycles too. This has been a slow and steady process for you guys. Uh, flying above the karmic cycles here. Um, you're cleaning house. You're getting rid of anything that no longer serves you. You are feeling protected. You both have that energy of protection of your angels around you. Energy number two, please. Energy number two, please. For Libra, for the collective, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Energy. Wow. High Priestess of Earth. So you could be a Capricorn, Virgus, Virgo, or Taurus. Or it's just that you're embodying um, that energy. Or you're just looking to get very grounded right now. You're, you're working. You're cleaning house. You're you're um you're spending more time in nature i feel you're starting to come to this very big understanding that you're being called wow you you're being called to some sort of life purpose uh libra or libra's person of interest cross watcher yeah to move you guys have both gotten the move i'm gonna take that for the union i feel like yeah to make a a leap forward Aries just got this energy too. One more for the for the energy between them. 
meditation. You guys could be meeting in meditation. And we have movement. You guys, I feel, have worked really hard and long on bringing things together. Because I feel like coming together, like I feel like you guys were both really single with that one ring circus uh, coming out. Yeah, look at that. Things are starting to come to life for you guys. Yeah, somebody had a choice to make. You guys have two doors to walk through. I feel like the choice is going to be made. Slow and steady again. It's been a slow process, but it is coming to life. Yeah, you guys have had some mountains to climb right now, but I feel like you've learned a lot of lessons and your guides are encouraging you to go down this beautiful path here. This magic prayer, this beautiful connection. I would like to get one overall, please, for the joint energy. Thank you. It's time to take action, Libra. Wow. New moon in Aries. Look at this. A new start is coming. New, new moon. This could be by the next new moon. Beautiful. Okay, let's see what's in the heart space of energy number one towards energy number two please spirit what's in the heart space there is going to be an extended guys um just click to the right of the screen here at the end it is free on youtube what's in the heart space of energy number one please for libra some moon rising and venus for energy number two heart space please thank you let's have one flip purification so I feel like all that karma that you've been through all these life generations have really purified your heart so it has room to love is what I'm getting getting pulled to another deck here heart space place for energy number one towards energy number two for Libra Sun Moon Rising and Venus please Wow, that's beautiful that your heart has your your heart has room, I feel. Wow. Oh. It's time to write your own story here now. I feel like this relationship has really been affected by the moon. I'm not going to take all those. But we have um 7 of cups energy with union with the rainbow five changes coming in and remember we had that make a choice so i do feel like it's energy number one that has a choice to make here it could be between lovers it could just be to move towards energy number two let's get one more into this deck heart space please no we're saying other deck okay Heart space, please, for energy. Whoa. They dream about this happy ending. I think they've already made their choice. The choice is in... It, it showed up. Yeah, look. The choice of the union. Who to pick. To take the leap of faith. To be flexible. Wow. To plant the seeds. Look at this. To happy, happy. I feel like this person's strategizing right now how to get there saw the strategy card okay what's in their thought space what's in their thought space please energy number one the thought space please unfoldment peace is unfolding um this new energy is unfolding for them this new understanding i'm feeling yeah look at this the possibilities they're thinking about the possibilities with you What are they thinking about? Thank you. Oh, they're thinking about the Divine Feminine. This could be very much the energy of the Masculine. Wow, they think it's time. It's Divine Timing. It's like clockwork. They can't stop thinking about you. Very strong. What are they thinking about? It's too much. No, we're saying take them and the bottom one. 
Okay, so there has been uh, cycles that you guys have been going through together or separate. They are healing though. Okay, if something that you were, t this energy was tied to something, it was creating a lot of hostility in their, in their mind, but they can't get out of their head how they feel that this relationship is faded. Wow, let's get, I'm gonna wait for the action because I always like to see who I feel I would take action first. Um, okay, let's see where energy number two is for energy number one, please. Don't forget to hit subscribe, guys. Hit the bell if you want notifications. I'm going to be uploading every two weeks for the signs. Uh, and then in between, I do my personal readings and I do uh, pick a card. And I think I'll start doing some spiritual readings as well. Nurturing. This person in their heart space is very caring and loving person. I do feel like you could be uh, Virgo, Capricorn, or Taurus with this nurturing. Because we also had the High Priestess of Earth. Things are starting to shape shift in your heart too. You're starting to release something here. Oh, your compassion. You might be starting to really show this person how you feel. You may have been holding back a little bit. This could be a brand new relationship altogether. Or it's, it's like this new connection coming back around after years or something. Because, yeah, it feels effortless. So you guys may have known each other in the past. But it looks like there was some hesitation. Somebody had some choices to make here. Let's see here. Energy number two towards... Okay, thank you, heart space. So I feel like this person also had... Remember we had that mountains card? You've had a lot of mountains to climb when it comes to love. And you've had to cut out some bullshit too in your life and being pulled. Yeah, some karmic cycles. So... If this is the energy between you two, Libra, then I feel like you're both cutting out the crap. Um, if this is a brand new relationship, I feel like you guys are making room for each other. Yeah, look at that for the luck to come in. The emotions, the big picture, the offers of love and this emotional watery feeling, but grounded with that King of Cup energy. Wow. Heart space, please, for number one towards number two. Whew. So this person on this side is thinking about number one a lot. They could be talking uh, about you a lot. This Because this could be a therapist or somebody else that they're talking to. Their heart just wants to tell you how much they like feel for you. Energy number two is like on fire for energy number one. That's a very sexual energy, the second chakra. It's also a creative um, energy, so they could be wanting to voice something that they want to do together to create. Where's their thought process here? Where's their thought per process here? Now, energy, energy number two towards energy number one. What are they thinking about here? When they think about this person, thank you. Yeah, they're using their discernment whether to hold back or pull forward here. They're having their strength here to overcome anger. So if you guys have had the karma in your past, that's what they're thinking about. They're trying to get the strength to get over it. Yeah, to prosper. Look at that past, the cycles that you've been through. They're really trying to, um, yeah, it's the partnership. Yeah. Wow, okay. Let's see. What else are they thinking about? Yeah, they're thinking about this choice. What way are you going to decide to go? Are you going to offer them this beautiful rose? Look at this. We have making a choice in the middle. This person is making a choice. And look, we have it here again. They're thinking long and hard. They're wondering what you are going to do, energy number one. Yeah, they just want to build again. They want to plant new seeds. They want to do over. They want to start all over again. Let's see what energy number two or number one is going to do. I feel like they're the ones that have to make the decision. Let's see what is, what, um, is energy, what action are they going to take towards energy number one. 
They're watching you right now. They're watching you. I feel like they want to show you their heart. They're, I don't know if they're going to make action right away. This is the second time, though, that we've seen the strategy card. They're trying to figure out how they're going to tell you about how they feel, how they really feel. Yeah, which is this happy family. They keep getting that card. Okay, what's going to happen on your end? What Number two. Number two, you think it's unfinished business here. Woo! You're, I feel like... Yeah, you want victory. Look at this. Unfinished symphony. Symphony. You're having the strength, I feel, to hold back your communication. Because we kind of seen that here before. Um, but you do want this to be victorious. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm going to get messages quickly before my camera shuts off. And then I'm going to move to the extended. Join me up at the top. One message for energy number one. Yeah, they're letting go of something. They're letting go. Energy number two. What do we got here? Explore and growth. And for the union, energy is building between you two. Yeah, you guys are surrendering to the connection and you're transforming. Beautiful. Surrendering. Growth for number two and exploring. I feel like you could have options, energy number one. Much love, light, and laughter, and stay empowered.